Oh, what's going on, ladies and gentlemen? This is Demo Storm, and welcome to Ragnarok. Yes, today we're going to be going on to my PvE server. I'm going to be starting a series here. Um, what I basically did was I added S plus, also Aberration Dinosaurs, to Ragnarok. Um, but yeah, this is my server. There's people on it. Um, I'm actually hosting a building tournament on the server as well, so you're going to see some cool bases laying around as we play through. Um, my plan is to actually... So I've done a little bit of map scouting in my free time, but um, we're gonna be heading to the scorched earth biome. Um, it's gonna be a super dangerous thing. I wanted to get a horse and kind of hold. I forget what the movie's called, but uh, when the guy ran the horse across um, the Sahara, I'm actually gonna give myself health because it's gonna be difficult. And I'm coming over here to actually get carrots. This is very important because I'm just going to tame a horse like right away and we're going to basically up his speed the whole time, get him to move into the thing. The rates are, I believe, 10 times, so it's not hard for the people in the building competition along with people who are just playing. Um, if you want to get on the server, you become a Twitch, it's a sub slash backer server, so either being a Twitch sub or a Patreon backer. Patreon backers only get in once a month. Twitch subs get in as they get the email for the whitelist. Um, but yeah, that, that explains that mostly. But yeah, let's get on to uh, playing the game. There is a base in there. I know there is. He's he's part of the building competition, I believe. Um, but there will be a video showing off all the builds on the thing. And then um, the best two will be picked by viewers who wins the competition. And there is a prize. Um, I, think it's, I think I determined that it's going to be a $20 game. Um and if there's two people in the tribe, it's split, so it's two $10 games. Probably Shell Shock or something. They'll get to the side. Um, but yeah, we'll figure that out as time comes on. But I want to build it in the Scorched Earth biome. I feel like it's going to be an interesting part. A lot of people aren't living there, which makes it even better. Um, do I have to be a certain level to tame a horse? I don't remember. Level 10. Okay. That answers that question. So we can level up quite quick with the current bonuses to... Uh, Multipliers. Yeah. Alright, hold my stamina up, grab water. We need to get our basic tools going. There's some wood over here. We have to be careful, this is a giga area. Um, I love this map though. Just having that big open field there is pretty awesome. But let's see. Move over here. I don't remember. No, you can't pick these. Okay. Yeah, all the S plus stuff. Here's the aberration stuff that you can build. You basically build a workbench and you transfer resources to become that. So one rare mushroom equals that mushroom, see? Et cetera, et cetera. It's like a fair trade kind of system. All right. We're in the S plus fire. Water. We're going to need a lot of water sacks before we move. Um, yeah. Build that right away. We need food. I'm actually gonna pick these potatoes. I mean, we can eat our carrots. We have plenty to tame. But yeah, you're gonna get, you're gonna get a lot of level ups in the beginning. Um, that's bound to happen with ten times or whatever. It's not bad. I'm I'm like indifferent to. Uh, quicker speeds now because the grind to get to certain levels is just the same thing over and over and over and sometimes that just gets me it's just it's you don't really want to do it over and over and over sometimes you just want to relax and do what you want to do you know especially with the tlc update coming out everyone's going to want to tame those new dinosaurs everywhere this should level us up pretty sure or get us close Keep a good stack of wood on me. Do I have a stack mod on? I don't believe so. S plus camp. We learned water sack. Yep. Alright. Thank you. There we go. Craft a hat. I'm going to put a point into weight because weight's going to be a problem. And let's get our head on. There we go. Clothed. That's enough clothes. Right. 
Yeah. Alright, let's see. We are level 7. Once we have a horse, everything just gets way easier from moving around the map. Um, but the travel of the Scorched Earth is super dangerous. I saw a lot of basilisks in the Scorched Earth biome. So hopefully we can survive out there. Um, desert armor will probably be a thing. That's 28. We might have to build like a staging point here. And then move out. There's unicorns that spawn down there. I've seen them down there. Um, Code lives over there. In that direction. Let's um move this way. Hopefully, eventually, we'll have a griffin as well and a rock drakes. Rock drakes are also on the map. I have breeding up a little bit high so people can breed them quicker. Things like that. Um, let's see. Yeah, but it's 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 a PVE experience. So I'm hoping people will be entering into the building competition. Um, you know, people will be enjoying the server. Is anybody talking? No. Usually, they just use Discord. Yeah. Also, a wingsuit. A wingsuit would be good. Traveling around Ragnarok with a wingsuit, I think, would be fun. But that's going to, you know, involve a little bit of effort. A little tiny bit. Uh, we can gain our levels by using trees. I'm just looking for a good point to, like, harvest from. There's not a lot of trees in this area. All right. Here, we're going to... I think I have a plan. I'm going to stage from here for our winter travel or our desert travel. And then we can actually pick up our base once it's done. Make life easy. Alright. Yeah, we're going to gain a lot of levels here, so I'm actually going to turn down the in-game music. I know, sacrilege. Everyone loves that sound that they hear every single time they level up. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna try our best to kind of be a cool little building. Can't snap that direction, but... There we go. Perfect. It's got that... that different feel um we also have no collision on the server so things will be good kind of build right along that rock ledge yeah i like that i like that a lot level eight once we have a horse i mean we can get all the resources we need to move around the map i'm actually gonna eat some more carrots oh, there we go just what we need Metal nearby. We got wood. We got thatch. What is holding me back? Might actually be fiber. Alright. Please just get to level 10. That way everything gets easier. Start using horses to do things. Silk is going to be good. Alright, we need four ceilings, so I'm just going to... Wood now. Perfect, that should be level 10. No? Dang. Damn. There we go. We got... Doo -doo -doo. Two ceilings. We need two more. Out of thatch. <laughs> That's level 10, though. That's just what we wanted. All right. So now we gotta we gotta find a horse that we actually want. Um. Five now. The levels are supposed to be higher. I don't know what's going on with them. Um. If you guys know how the difficulty works in the game for settings for a server, please let me know. Because I've set it how I used to set it, and it didn't go up. So we're very confused. Um, yeah, I, I don't... Not really sure. I used to be able to set it this way, and it would be 120, and now it's only 30. And then there's now the offset versus difficulty value, and it's all weird. Not really sure. So if you guys get it, please let me know. 
So let's see. But now I'd have to do it incrementally because there's people on the server, so you do it slowly and build up. Uh, I need to find a horse that I actually want. Three and five is not really the place I want to be for, like, levels. So, hopefully we find something decent. Like, half decent. Live off potatoes and carrots. <laughs> I forgot the temperatures on this map can be a little all over the place. There's a horse. Alright, we maybe we should just tame one and then look for others. Use the lasso and things like that. Start capturing more horses. Drag around sheep. You know. The usual. Alright, you're cool color. So let's There we go. And I'll let the comment section name it. Perfect. It just needs a couple levels, but I mean, we can get there. Galley Mimus. I gotta be really careful of Gigas. Gigas are a thing. There's Code's base. I'm not gonna show that off, because that's his. So you guys can see it in the distance. I know that's definitely Code. That's where he wanted to build. Alright. Start moving across the map. I'm gonna give you the carrots. No. I'm gonna give you a hat. No, I probably can't dress you until... Yeah, until you have a saddle. Makes sense. Ooh, we are cold. Alright, we gotta get the fire up. We gotta get our house built. We gotta start working on leveling up this horse to get it, you know, fast enough. Maybe beat up some sheep. Uh, movement speed, please. We'll cancel out its dance. There we go. It's a good source of metal here, too. And then we have to go that way to the desert. So. Hopefully we can get that done. What are you doing? This is what we have to deal with. Jesus, we're pooping a lot. Let me thatch. Uh, we're gonna gamma four. There's our thatch right there. Due to the cold, we need to eat. We have a lot of potatoes. Hopefully that will help us gain what we need. Pick up these branches. I forgot that's how this works. Alright. S plus fire. S plus is cool. Um... With the side of being able to pick things up, I don't agree with some of the stuff that they do, though. Um, I think it makes things a little easy. But that's me. That's just me. I built two of these? I don't remember doing that. Okay. Hopefully. Need a level. Put a shirt on. Now we need meat. We can use our horse to kill things. Alright. Yeah, use the horse. Kill a sheep. And then what you do is you turn the meat into food. Food into everything else. We also need the hide for when we get bow. Bow is going to be very important. There's our sheep now. Start making our way. We have a little bit brighter for you guys. Oh, I love damage numbers. I know a few people don't, but 
honestly letting me know that I'm doing you know how much damage I'm doing and if this dinosaur is actually worth it is always nice I gotta be careful with pelt. We must have a stack mod going. It's you. <laughs> it would be code. <laughs> I don't know what he's doing over there. Or how he found me that quickly. Yeah, he always knows where I am. The lurker. But for anybody who doesn't know, that's Codename Ace. Fellow YouTuber. Good friend. Known him for ever now, I would say. Um, but yeah, let's let's head back to what we were doing before we get sidetracked by Mr. Code. Yeah, we do have a stack mod. Okay. See, I don't even remember the mods that I have. That's how long it's been. All right. Warm up a little bit. Let's see. Stacks plus walls. There we go. I could also head down south, get metal tools instantly, but it's a far travel with your metal tools. There we go. Some sort of structure that needs to cook for a little bit. It is now early morning. I need fiber, yeah. Stop kicking things. You know, it's bound to happen, though. All right. And now it is thatch. It's always thatch. It's going to be an ongoing battle in the beginning of the game between thatch and fiber and wood. All right, hopefully... You're cool looking. All right, let's see. Go right down there. I see our thatch. Are you good at getting thatch? I forget. Hmm. Let's check it out. No, you don't get thatch. All right, not a big deal. That should be good for what we need. Make sure we kind of match everything. Um, that's me who leveled. Okay. Oop. Potatoes on the hot bar. Simple. Go back to the normal gamma three. Yep, there we go. I try and keep an eye out for what it will look like for you guys, but it doesn't always work out. Yeah, but our little shelter on the cliff is is coming along nice. I made mistakes. All right. We need ramp. Ramp. What do we need for this one ramp so we can get inside our base? Nothing. Okay. All right. 
Oh yeah, auto doors. Thank you. Much nice, such wow. Cool, we got lamb chops now. Build our health up quite easily. And now we're gonna start leveling. Ooh. It is time for 15. So that means... There we go. And as you can see, the glow sticks. We can start building triangles, things like that. But we're going to end here. Thank you guys for joining me for the first episode. Let me know if you want to see more of the PvE season. Um, basically, we're going to travel to the desert. Then we're going to build big. We're going to build big. want to build a nice base. But until next time, guys, I've been Demo. Have a wonderful day.